look what came in the mail. <laughs> Let me show you. Can y'all guess what this is? Can y'all guess what this is? Quit playing with me. It's my laptop. It finally came, y'all. Okay. Okay, let's open up the package. Hold on, I'm gonna open this. Okay, so it came with a charger. Oh, oh. First impressions, I'm already seeing a little bit of a scratch right there. Okay, the front looks really good. This is how the front looks. It looks so pretty. Hold on, let me let me show y'all. Open it up. And then it opens up like this. <laughs> Got a little Chinese already showing it. What's up? <laughs> Look how good that looks. Y'all look so good. <laughs> I don't know that's right. Yes, I'm obsessed, y'all. Using English as the main language. Press the return key. Okay, period. That's all we speak over here is English, baby. But this to be like a refurbished computer, like quality wise, it looks so good. Let me give y'all a better look. Cause I'm so excited. <laughs> look how good this looks, y'all. Hardly no stretches or anything. Like the quality looks really, really good. So let's go ahead and select English. Make sure the mouse is working. Cool, bit, bit. Yep, United States. That's where I reside. <laughs> All right, y'all, so we are to the home screen currently, y'all. This is how it looks so good. Let's go ahead and test the app. Let's test it. Oh, oh there we go. Come on, Leah. Let's go to YouTube. Let's go to YouTube. Okay, period. We on YouTube, y'all. We on YouTube. Look, it's just going. Okay, let me go to my channel. Let me go to my channel. Look, that's me. Oh, that is me, y'all. Make sure y'all subscribe to my YouTube channel. By the way, we are going... We are doing Vlogmas this year, but we're doing weekly Vlogmas because, girl, as you already know, if you haven't already watched the last video for Vlogmas, definitely go ahead and check that out, y'all. Like, it is cute, a whole vibe. Like, you'll love it. So, definitely check me out on YouTube, girl. Period. So, this is a new laptop, y'all. And it comes with, um, let me pause this. It comes with, like, touch screen and stuff, so... Like for example, this thing like right here, I can just hit the play button and it's just gonna go without having to like, you know, use my mouse pad to do it. Um, I think you could turn up the volume. Yeah, you could turn up the volume right here, the brightness. Um, I can do the brightness, yeah, the brightness of it. I can do this and it'll um, expand and minimize the screen. I can do this to show all the apps like it's just so cool it's like this little it's called a magic keyboard i can access siri right here as well um, so yes yeah, so this whole touch bar up here is um touch screen and y'all i got a case too so let me show y'all the case that i got to go with it because you know i gotta keep my baby protected okay she's new so um i definitely have to keep her protected oh and this is a macbook 13 y'all i was gonna get um, the brand new one but I was like I'm not dropping that kind of money on a MacBook right now because I just feel like uh, one that is a little bit more older is just going to do me just as good and um, yeah I really needed a new MacBook. So my old MacBook was the 11 and I got it back in 2012-2013 when I went to college and I've had it for like a good 10 years and it's definitely done me well but at this point she's not working that well anymore she's super slow applications are not um being uh, working properly and not only that but a lot of the apps that you would normally download i can't download but i did go ahead and order me a case from amazon yesterday to get that got here and i wanted to put this on because i need to keep my baby protected you know what i'm saying so let's put that on right now i'm so excited y'all like <laughs> And I'm getting ready to go ahead and um, put up the tree too in a minute. But this how I came in the mail. And I was like, I got to show my girls. I got to show y'all. Because I'm just too excited and I can't wait. Has a little green keypad and then the back to go with it. Got a little keyboard. Oh, 
it gave you multiple. It gave you two keyboards. Okay. Oh, look at that. Hold on. I'm just too excited, y'all. She's giving luxury, okay? Don't play with her. Don't play with her. Hey, y'all. Welcome, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to Vlogmas Week 2, girl. Listen, it has been a week. I think the last time I checked in with you guys, I was getting my MacBook and or opening it up, I should say. And I absolutely love it, of course. Um, this week, y'all, has been so, so chill. Um, it hasn't been too much going on. As you can see, your girls in the car. We are on our way to the fashion show. I know I talked to you guys last week. I told you guys that I was going to a fashion show this week, so that's where I am headed right now. I did not get a chance to um, check in with you guys before I left because, child, I am literally rushing to get down here. The event starts at 4 o'clock, so I'm trying to get there by 4.30, but it's looking like 4.45, may even be even 5, I don't know. My friend is on her way, and I'm supposed to be meeting her there. I'm super excited for this fashion show. I didn't really look at a lot of details like I should have. This honestly has been like probably the least prepared that I've ever been to go to an event um, show or whatever. Um, normally I'm normally on top of it. I'm seeing like where I'm going and all of that, but I have not checked anything. Matter of fact, speaking of, let me put in this GPS because I don't even know where I'm going. The event is supposed to be from four to 11 but I am not staying for the entire time. 181. Third Street, let's see. Oh, it's gonna take me an hour and 14 minutes. So it's looking like, Starting room ooh, I don't get there until 510, y'all. Whoopsie daisy. Let me let her know real quick before I get on this freeway. So I let her know where what time i'm arrived which is gonna be another hour from now event in um san francisco is from 4 to 11. i looked at some of the designers from the fashion show and girl they are eating for sure and so i tried to do a little something with the outfit but it did not it definitely failed for sure of what i was trying to do because i feel like when you go to a fashion show you know you want to like come with it you know you want to come with the fit hey it's not gonna we just gonna do what Brianna is gonna do, and we gonna just throw on a little jumpsuit, and so that's what I did. Um, again, this has all been very last minute, not prepared type of thing going on with me. All week I've been like trying to figure out what am I gonna wear, what what shoes am I wearing, how I'm doing my hair. Like I have been trying to figure that out, and nothing has been clicking. So I just was like, okay. We got a jumpsuit in there, we just wanna throw that on, put some boots on. I got this little fur jacket that I got last year. Um, it's holiday-ish. The, the dress code is supposed to be holiday cocktail. And I didn't even realize that until last minute. I knew it had something to do with holiday, but I didn't really necessarily read all the information. I feel like what I have on is holiday cocktail. You know, it's it's dressy, right? I, well, y'all don't know, we'll see. Y'all see in a minute. When I get there, I'ma show y'all the outfit, hopefully. Y'all think it eats too. I don't know. I think it's cute. But let me know in the comments when y'all see the outfit. Let me know if it's giving, okay? I need to know from y'all what, you know, if it's cute or not. Oh no, is it? Don't tell me it's traffic all the way back here. Wait a minute. What's going on? Okay, he lost his tire on the side of the road. Okay, so we're good. I thought it was about to be traffic because you know how our bikes are slowing down. You be thinking it's some traffic finna creep. But anyway, next week I actually have my furniture coming. Like, I'm so excited, you guys. Like, my furniture is coming. Like, I cannot wait because my room has not been, it has not been up to par. It's decent, it's cleaned up, but it's not, you know, when you don't have any furniture, like, uh, hello, it's not gonna be where it needs to be or where you want it to be. So, um, I'm so happy it's coming. I'm so excited quality of the dressers I've been hearing is really really good it better be because this furniture was not cheap so I'm hoping that you know all is well and I love the furniture when it gets here I'm not gonna lie I did not really want to go like it's like of course I want to go but then I don't want to go and it's more so just me being like a whole introvert like I have to literally push myself to get out the house to do something like I need to socialize I need to network and I need to push myself out there to do that and it's hard for me to do that especially since I just love being in my own space in my own home 
you know like it's just I don't have to worry about all these different energies or like having to like keep up with the different conversations and things like that you know I don't know maybe that's just me but it's like I'm excited to go but at the same time it's like oh I gotta get dressed I gotta like put my face on and you know be in front of people and mingle and network and all of that which is good like that's what I need to be doing for sure but y'all get it just being introvert being in the house like I just love my me time and I'm about to check in with you guys when I get to the fashion show I'm gonna show y'all the fit and all that and I'm gonna holla at y'all later on Ooh, this one's for you Baby, you my everything You all I ever wanted We could do it real big Bigger than you ever done it You be up on everything Oh, thank you Is it like all these? The candles? Yeah, yeah, yeah Oh, thank you Oh, thank you Oh, thank you Get it, girl, it's good <laughs> Yeah, I love it Had it for a couple years I love it Yeah Hi Hi That's how you like that no, you got a roommate. Call me when there's no one there. Put the key under the mat, and you know I be over there. I be over there. Shout it, I be over there. I be hitting all the spots that you ain't even know it's there. And y'all don't even have to ask twice. You can have a heart, or we can share it like the last slice. Always felt like you were so accustomed to the fast life. Have a nigga thinking that he met you in a past life. Sweatpants, hair tied, chilling with no makeup on. That's when you're the prettiest. I hope that y'all don't take it wrong. Y'all don't even trip with friends, say you ain't bring a drink along. You know that I'm working, I'll be there soon as I make it home. Cause she a pension in my waiting room. Never pay attention to the rumors and what they assume. And until them girls prove it, I'm the one that never get confused with cause baby, you my head. Sex, love, pain, baby, I be on that tank Buzz so big, I could probably sell a blank this Quit my album, drop the vibe for the picture And niggas are buying to and claim they got it for their sister To celebrate the warmth, prosperity, beauty, and fashion Walking over there in the city There's no seats, so I'm just going to Oh, she brought me to 70 Yeah, and for those of you who don't know I am a startup techie And I moonlight as a fashion blogger so I'm so excited to be here. So are you ready for the highlight of the evening? So we're opening the Ready to Wear Fashion Show with Louis Klein, David Louis Klein. And he uses his original photo art, which is amazing. The dresses are made for women everywhere in the style of Chung Song and Chi Pao to enhance the, be enhance the beauty, grace, and elegance of the women who love dresses with beautiful prints. Oh. The hope is that they will choose their dresses to wear like an art collector does. He chooses a painting to adorn their walls to appreciate and wear forever. All right, let's get started.
fashion show and they I guess they're like in a mission or something and so I literally had a one-way like seat in the middle of the runway but the girl gave up my seat because I had got here right when it first started so they actually moved us outside now so we can actually sit down because we were standing up because it was no seats by the time I got back up here because I went to get my cocktail and to find you know my friend Hopefully y'all can hear me. I don't know. It's kind of loud, but we're outside. Look at it. It's yeah. So at least when we come, the runway is like literally right there, so I can kind of see everybody that's coming out. Um, so at least that's a plus. Hopefully my lace is not lifting. I don't know. Part and then so yeah, y'all stay tuned for more looks. charge you 40 but I'm gonna charge you 36 okay that's that, that sounds good thank you because because you were longer that's why a couple of minutes early, no, right? no she were you were longer <laughs> <laughs> I just got here like an hour ago oh, okay. yeah. or an hour a little hour, Ooh, hour, an hour. Too fancy. I didn't even clean her don't scratch her I didn't even clean her <laughs> yeah I do yeah better put on Right. Nice. She looks nice. Not the part. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. We'll see you guys later. Right, nice nice to, meet to meet you. you. See ya. Okay. Bye, yeah. Look forward for my invitation. Okay. Let me know. Yeah. She gets in the car with you. Oh, you coming with me? Bye. 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 Y'all try to stay. Get home. I mean, get to where y'all need to get to safely. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I just think your signature not be a copy to receive it. Okay, not really wet panic, but we don't just right. make That's it a nice work. Nice camera. Is it pretty clear? Huh? Yeah, pretty clear. it's pretty clear. Okay. 
Thank you know the, you. You know those old cameras are now worth some money now, huh? Yeah, yeah. The ones with the Kodak. Uh, mm hmm Me too. Hey y'all, today is Sunday and I wanted to hop on here and check in with y'all because I haven't talked to y'all since last night at the Last Look Fashion Show event, y'all. Actually, I had a really, really good time. It was definitely a vibe for sure. I always love going to these type of events because everyone's vibe is just such good energy. Everyone's always super nice and it's just like an experience to be there and be around people who are like like-minded and um, be able to like mingle and talk to people um i really wish i would have went a lot earlier than i did um because for one i missed the vip like they give you an hour basically to like network and like you know take pictures and just talk to people and just kind of get the vip benefits that um, everyone else isn't necessarily privy to um, before the actual event starts so I definitely next time I'm invited to one of these events I'm gonna make it a point to get there early so that I can be able to mingle with other people because I started talking to this one girl and we were really like hitting it off and y'all know I ain't got no friends like that outside of like you know our cyber friends I should say people on the, the internet so I'll be trying to like make new friends and like mingle and network with different people because you just never know when you talk to different people like where it can take you whether that's personally growth wise or it could be your career wise like you just never know so um i was talking to this girl and we like kind of started conversating but then I, my friend had called me and so i had to like stop talking to her to go meet up with my friend and not to say there's anything about about that but i think that um, if i would have gotten there early i really could have taken my time you know getting there getting situated getting equated versus like getting there feeling like i'm rushed like oh i have to do this i have to do that like the fashion show was literally starting like 20 minutes before i got there so like i had to like check in i had to get um, my bearings together I had to get my little compliment compl complimentary cocktail and like mingle a little bit before I was able to get to the fashion show and it was like rushed right into there so it was just like there was no type of time for, for myself or really time for me to like really just kind of take it all in everything was just super rushed and then when I first got there the guy was like oh you just go to the fourth floor um, that's where they're having the event at so I went straight to the, four, the fourth floor it really wasn't anyone up there which was super weird but everyone was like waiting outside this door to go inside the fashion show that's where you kind of show like the I showed the empty room of no one in there and that means I guess I got there right when the fashion show was supposed to be starting right at six o'clock but they were running behind so it didn't really start to like 6 15 6 30 ish um so then that's when i had met the girl i was talking to her for a second she was asking me about my camera and we were talking a little bit about content and things like that and then i kind of had had a seat right in the middle of the runway which would have been the perfect seat y'all to get the best content and just to like be able to see everything as well without a whole bunch of people in the way but then my friend caught me and I had to meet up with her so then I had to go back and leave that area but then when I left the area I asked the girl to like save my seat and she was cool with it but then by the time I met with my friend and came back I didn't even see her sitting in the same seat so I don't know if she left, got up and left or she moved but your girl, your, the seat was gone the seat was gone and I had to end up standing up right in the front of the doorway which is why you guys saw me kind of like back inside the room um, standing up and then later on they moved us outside during intermission i think i mentioned this earlier before in the vlog as well so that was that but it, it was okay like it was fine um they definitely had different vendors there of course so you can definitely like like that like my friend ended up getting her uh like a bracelet uh done or put on which was super expensive you guys it was like 130 for the charm and then like no 130 for the bracelet and then 30 dollars for the charm y'all and yeah it was it was definitely expensive they, they had like drinks they had food like they had clothes they had a lot going on um there but i missed a lot of it getting there so so late um i kind of got there right in the middle of everything and it didn't end to 11 so i mean i could have definitely stayed longer and kind of experienced more but then the parking y'all the parking was 20 dollars an hour so once i heard that i was like yeah no I need to hurry up, get get into this event, see the fashion show, and I was out because I was not about to pay, 
you know all that money to be parked in there like even though i didn't pay a ticket to go to the event like the parking you'll be spending at least a hundred seven dollars easily just being there for four or more hours like no so i wasn't gonna do that so i left around 7 30 ish i had got there around 5 30 so i was only there for a couple of hours not very long at all definitely in the next events i think i want to try to go by myself just to kind of get that experience and kind of really take my time and like mingle with people i want to get there early so that's definitely going to be my goal but they definitely did give us a little goodie bag this was tied before so ignore that um but this is what it looks like it says the last look which was the name of the event and this is super cute got a little these little uh snowflakes on there love that very holiday festive and then let's see let's open it up let me do a little unboxing so i can see what you know what came in the bag uh they first have like this little kibon beauty skincare thing going on here so this is just like some information about it again this is from what is this keep on beauty um talks about the ingredients and things that are on or in the in the mask itself and we love a good mask so they give you one two three four five different okay so they give you five of them it says radiant max brightening and repairing is what it says gives you directions in the back how to use it so also in the bag is this smooth calm me down antioxidant cleanser um this is what it looks like let's actually open it up so this is what it looks like again this is a cleanser it smells really good kind of vanilla it smells like vanilla yeah it has like a citrus vanilla smell it's supposed to be for all skin types um essential oil free vegan friendly and ph balance so let's see what else they have in here they have some good wipes rose water it says but deserve better so you know a little feminine white let's see what else do we have in here some freckle farm organics youth serum this is supposed to be 24k gold infused has vitamins a b c d e k omega 3 6 7 and 9 it says uh look the luxurious oils in our serum have been mindfully curated to achieve a radiant youthful glow and uplift your spirits i know that's right this nice little cute black aesthetic bottle we love good some good aesthetics okay they gave us some cute little bead bracelets these are water resistant strong grip looks cute on your wrist no it looks cute in your hair and on your wrist it reduces headaches, damage, crease in your hair. Okay, so what are these like little hair tie? Oh, it's a hair tie. Okay, so it's a strong grip, no rip, hair tie that gives back. Okay, uh, it's supposed to be no damage, no creases in your hair. Okay, I definitely need that because I be needing to put my hair up in a ponytail and I hate the little crease that it gives when I do that. So we have some coupons in here. Let's just show y'all a haul that I did or I got from Pretty Little Thing. If Should I show y'all my haul? I don't know. Should I show y'all or should I just let it go into the next vlog and then show y'all then? I'm going to show y'all. I'm going to go ahead and show y'all. So I'm going to show you guys a few items that I got from Pretty Little Thing. First is going to be this little knitted sweater dress. This is really cute. It is a bit big. The sleeves are humongous. Um, but they always typically are. So I just kind of roll them up. I'm thinking about returning this though and getting a smaller size. I believe I got this in a double XL, but I have it on the screen. But this is how it looks. It hits me right below like my knee right there. But it is very, very stretchy, really cute and warm. And I think this is a really cute lounger outfit. Um, or it could just be like a cute little running errands outfit as well. I see me pairing this with some brown boots, maybe even like a cute little brown bag actually let me show you the bag this bag that i just got from amazon recently super cute this would go really perfectly with this look you guys i love this and then some brown boots to match i also have this in orange too let me show you all that this is the orange one that i also have it's really really great quality you guys I love it. I don't have anything in it, which is why it's flat, but these are the colors beside it. I first got the orange one. I was like, oh, I really like this orange one, the quality. So I got the brown one because I didn't even have a brown bag, believe it or not. But 
I think the brown will look really good with this again with some brown booties or some boots maybe with a little heel you can maybe do like a little belt or something if you wanted to kind of like snatch you up a very nice knitted material definitely love the quality on this but again for sure i suggest sizing down in this because it runs big so this is the next item y'all this is so warm and so cozy and cute it's like this long puffer jacket but it's kind of like sherpa too at the same time this is a sherpa up close and then this is how this part looks here um like this windbreaker windbreaker material let me see if i can show you all the bottom of it this is how it looks on the bottom it literally comes all the way down almost to my ankles but this is so warm it has pockets i think i got this in a size 20. if it's really good i probably could have gotten an 18 to be honest because it does have some stretch to it i zipped it all the way up so you guys can see how it looks for the inside though windbreaker material here so it's not sherpa inside it's just like that little windbreaker material so you don't have to worry about being too warm but you're definitely still warm so i definitely you probably could you know wear this in the cold weather for sure i feel like this is definitely giving winter gear definitely not for fall okay my light died on me so you may not be but this is the last item it's just this really nice trench coat um really good quality actually i think i got this in a size 2x this is how it looks up close um but it does have some buttons down the sides and it does come all the way down to my angles actually let me see if i can yeah comes all the way down to my ankles and it does have pockets it is pretty actually good quality um i think i got this in a size I think this is really really cute and nice for the winter as well. I think the material inside is also like windbreaker type of lining going on. But yeah, that is pretty much that. I did get a few other items, but y'all just need to stay tuned for that because I think I'm going to do a haul um or one of my little lookbook videos that i've been doing before um, but that's pretty much the end of that little mini haul for now those little two bags though i did also get from amazon i don't know if i mentioned that but i got them from amazon they were like 20 something a piece i'll have it linked down below as well as anything else i mentioned in this video as far as purchasing go but yeah y'all i'm about to hurry up and um get this last piece of footage into the vlog and start editing because it is time to wrap everything up so i can get this video out for y'all tomorrow so yeah y'all that is the end of today's video stay tuned y'all i got three videos dropping this week make sure you be on the lookout i am so close to monetization monetization and it's only up from here like what your girl wants to be monetized like i'm gonna be so hyped your girl almost at 2k <laughs> oh holla at your girl and if you made this far in this video you better make sure you subscribe subscribe to this video like it oh she share okay because obviously you rocking with your girl if you have made it this far in this video and i rock with you okay we we locked in okay ain't no switching up anyway i'm about to go because i'm gonna be talking forever but yeah thank y'all so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed it and i'll see y'all in the next vlog okay bye y'all